ladies and gentlemen, I've been seeing a major, major trend recently on this channel, and I don't like it. It makes me kind of sad. It makes me kind of upset. And that trend is the fact that nobody is liking and subscribing to the channel. You under go down, go downstairs, go downstairs right now. Check to make sure, check to make sure that you're subscribed and you've left a like. Go ahead. I'll wait. Okay, you done? Good, good. Because if it doesn't happen, if morale does not approve, the videos will stop. Who am I kidding? I'm not stopping the videos. Ladies and gentlemen, today we are spending, I mean, like literally, how do I pull this out? This first edition heavy team rocket pack. How do I pull this out and say that I'm gonna stop anytime soon? Just please like it, please subscribe. This is an expensive video. Ladies and gentlemen, first edition team rocket heavy pack. As you guys know, I am going for my completion. I still need the dark blastoise. I need still need that dark Charizard. I still need that dr dark Dragonite. I still need a lot of things to finish this off. So today we're opening one up. It is my second to last one that I have purchased. And we'll see ya. What if we can we can just somehow complete our first edition Team Rocket set because I really want to finish it. Anyway, so PO box today. We've got uh, a couple things. So we're gonna just go ahead and open all of it now since we're opening that Team Rocket thing at the end. I'm gonna be careful not to stab my monitor like it last episode. Here we go. There's one and a two and I three hi noah thank you for making such great content with my uh with my luck uh my luck with pokemon is really good i got the charger for my first 10 of shining fates i hate you i also congratulations also i pulled a card you need for one of your master sets and this leaves that card and a special surprise from reed also a note from reed's brother please make more warzone content well hey if you saw the stream i don't know when it is when you're watching this video but i recently streamed warzone again so there it is it was on variety day so let's see what oh it's poking out an Aracuda. Oh. Pain. <laughs> Pain. I can't. Okay. I can't remember if the Aracuda was one of the ones that I still needed. Cause so, so recently I found out where Shining Fates. Okay. It's not. I recently, I found out that Shining Fates, uh, I actually needed three more cards rather than just the Inteleon. But I think by the time he sent this, uh, that video wasn't up yet, obviously. But thank you so, so much, Reed and Reed's brother. I will make more Warzone content just for you, my friend. All right, we've got uh, next up, open first. I appreciate y'all. Thank you so much for sending that. Uh, greetings from Hawkeye State, Iowa. My name is Mark. My fiance, Jocelyn, and I have uh, really enjoyed your Pokemon card openings. So, uh, watching other YouTubers uh, like Nogla and Wildcat, to name a few. From Call of Duty, Modern Warfare, Warzone, to Pokemon, you guys' are, our videos are awesome and inspires us to do better over on my Twitch stream and YouTube channel. We look forward, uh, we'd like to hope we can keep the good work and we look forward to more awesome content. I'm more of a Yu-Gi-Oh! myself, but your videos help me looking for Pokemon cards as well. We found a few that could help with your Chilling Rain Master Set. One you may have already pulled, but any copies you can do with as you like. They are same in the sleeve, just so you know. Also including iconic Yu-Gi-Oh! cards, including some Blue Eyes variants that you can add to your growing collection. Enjoy them as I have. If we find any more cards, we'll shoot them your way. To cap this letter off, I hope you wouldn't mind giving our YouTube and Twitch channels a quick shout out. Uh, Crazer Cap? Crazer Cap. Hey, I got that right on the first try. Shout out to you. I'm going back on streaming soon, especially to raise money for charity through Extra Life. So you can follow me there. Jocelyn has a Twitch channel and still new at the name under Floofy Wolf. That's Floofy Wolfy. Floofy Wolfy. I actually love that name so much. Uh, may your pulls be trubbish free. Sincerely, Mark and Jocelyn. Hey, thank y'all so much. Super awesome letter. It's cool to see that y'all are both like in the hobby together. And uh, good luck on y'all's uh, channels. And huge shout out to uh, both y'all. For real, for real. Let's see what we got. I also I like the names y'all picked. That was great. So we have what in the... Okay, those are the cases. I was like, that's a lot of blue eyes. Here we go. Blue Eyes Spirit Dragon. I swear Yu-Gi-Oh! has literally just gone to, like, another dimension at this point. Blue Eyes Spirit Dragon. Malefic Blue Eyes White Dragon. Magical Hats. I remember that from the TV show. Spellbinding Circle. An absolute classic. And Magic Cylinder. Bro, I feel like all of these are just such big classics. This is a really, really cool. Thank you. I will actually... I, I'm, I'm trying to sort that out actually later today. On my Yu-Gi-Oh cards, so I will, uh, I will do that. I'm gonna try to put them into a binder and make them look all nice and pretty. And eventually, one day when I'm going over my entire card collection, I can include some Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. All right, next up, we've got Chilling Rain, Bada Bing, oh, Bada Bing, and Bada Boo! Wow. Okay, you went, you kind of went in, went in on the uh, Chilling Rain. I think I have, I have already pulled the Peony. Yeah, I've already pulled the Peony. By the time you send it. And a... Oh my god. 
Are you sure? Are you sure that you're a, uh, uh, a Yu-Gi-Oh collector, not a Pokemon collector? Because those are two fire cards right there. I, I unfortunately have pulled both of them already. Uh, like I said, I've been getting really, really lucky. And apparently you have too with the, uh, with the, what's it called? Um, rainbow trainers, but thank you so much. I will, I will definitely find a good use for those. Appreciate you very, very much. All right. So let's get into the card part of the openings, dude. We have like literally chapters and episodes. Oh, last thing, last thing before we get into this booster box, which I will just go ahead and open up last thing. My Mewtwo collection, the Mewtwo's that have come in through the mail that I have been finding, every single Mewtwo card that exists. We've got two more that came in today. These are the first sideways cards that I've gotten. Consciousness and congratulations. This is like right when Mewtwo is born. Bust out of his uh, cell there, or his tube there. And Mewtwo strikes back, leaving the nest. Two absolutely incredible. It's like scenes from the movie, so you'll be seeing a lot more of these. Every single one that has Mewtwo in it, I'm going to be buying in PSA grading for the collection, so... Two more cards right there. Put those in the send to PSA pile, which by the way, my send to PSA pile is getting very chonky. It is getting very, very chonky at this point. And there's a dark Raichu in there because it's literally in perfect condition. Um, yeah, PSA, if you could go ahead and open up anytime soon, that'd be great. So, Team Rocket Pack at the end of this, literally already off to a great start. I feel, I feel, I feel good about this booster box. I'm starting from the right side this time. Usually I've been starting from the left sides. I, oh no. Oh no. I think this, I think this started off the same way last episode where I started off with the Tornadus V and then we literally got nothing for like 45 minutes. Just kidding. Those episodes are not even close to being 45 minutes long. We started off with some bad, bad cards. We'll just put it that way. Nothing great was coming out of here. So we're going to hope to uh, change that. To, okay. I mean, again, I'm pretty sure this literally started off the exact same way last time. <laughs> oh, pain, 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 pain. I really hope, I really hope that this doesn't turn out the way that I'm thinking it might. <laughs> That's all right. No, 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 no. We're, we're, we're going we're gonna to stay positive. We're going to stay positive, positive, And we're going to get the big boy pulls. Let me move this knife over here because the knife is... Very large, very large. We got Snover right on the top. I still haven't figured out what my lucky card is. My lucky first card. If I see, like, if I see, okay, all right. I mean, it's it's a V Max. It's definitely the cooler one out of the Shadow Rider. I do like the Ice Rider V Max more so than the other one, but uh, it's not very rare at all, actually. It's like literally one of the least rare cards uh, in the V Max. I think it's that one in the Shadow Rider are tied for like the worst V Max cards you can get. But that's okay. As long as as long as the Blaziken V Max is hiding somewhere in here as well, we'll be we'll be happy campers. Bro, the day the day that I pull that Blaziken, I'm like I almost have just put it out of my mind at this point, and that I want to just be surprised. I don't want to be thinking about it. I don't want to be talking about the alternate art Blaziken the entire time. I just want whenever it happens, it's gonna happen type thing. I really really hope it eventually does, and I guess I'm kind of jinxing that by talking about it now. But eventually, eventually it's got to come, right? Dude, stop launching the cards, Noah. You big bum. <laughs> big bum. You don't know. Here we go. We got a Furfru. And we've got behind the Furfru. I feel like the Furfru could be my lucky. Okay, never mind. I lied. Furfru is not the lucky card. Also, I trimmed my nails. And it is much, much harder, I've noticed, to, to handle the packs when you have trimmed nails you know you don't got that little bit of extra strength you know what i mean dude i is this the effing same dude that i have already oh, okay thank goodness i was about to be so mad at you mr cybold i play i i'm so sorry i'm so sorry i pulled the rainbow version of you and i was about to rage but oh wait no i, li I literally where did i think i had a cybold okay what the uh, who cares dude let's go baby Full art trainer in the books, which is actually, I much prefer th to pull this over the rainbow one because I feel like the rainbow one has not, like, I, I, I feel like I'm already almost done with all the rainbow trainers. I I am actually super, super happy that we managed to pull that instead. All right, baby, let's go. Let's go, dude. Full art trainers are always pog and cybold. What, was that the furfuru? 
I really hope it was, because I'm calling for... I, anytime I get a Furfuru here, from now on, I'm calling Furfuru my lucky card. 100%. Furfuru is, is the big the big luck card now. If I see a Furfuru, I know it's going to be a fire pack. All right, here we go. This next pack's energy is going to be dark, by the way. Next pack is going to be dark. Here we go. And I don't I like I don't even care if I get something good here. Dang it, man. Fighting is super effective against dark. So so now now sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I, I knew I didn't realize that fighting because it was super effective uh against dark was gonna beat it out. So this will actually be psychic and then it will be dark. Ready? Dang it. It's <laughs> trying to craft a whole story there and it literally just ruined it with a fire pack. Come on, man. Score bunny. Oh, I'm getting hungry. What should I eat? What should I eat for dinner today, man? I've been trying to eat healthy. I've been on I've been on a little bit of a health uh, health grind recently. I mean, this is again after I got back from Las Vegas, which was just like eating a ton and drinking a ton. So I don't I don't know if you could call that like really that inspirational over here. <laughs> um, but ever since, I mean, I've been pretty good. I, I feel like I've been v eating very low carbs, no French fries, no, no breads, no unnecessary, uh, carbs type things. Just been eating some chicken and rice type stuff. Uh, but I, I dude, I'm, I'm pretty hungry right now. I could be tempted to get some like wings or something like that. Oh, dude, I could be, I could be mad tempted to get some wings or something. Oh, that sounds so good. No, I need everyone to try to convince me in this comment section. Say no, Noah. You, do you want to be fat? Dude, I, 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 I'm kind of sad. I think about this sometimes. I'm kind of sad because I never had what other kids had when I was growing up. And, and that you could literally just eat whatever you want and not gain any weight. Like, you know, a lot of kids have that. I'm sure most of you guys as kids had that. I never had that gift my entire life my entire life if i ate junk food or too much sugar or like too many carbs and stuff like that let's effing go baby let's effing go baby let's go melanie this is a full art trainer booster box right now give me another one give me hey literally just keep pumping out the full art trainers i am happy to take full art trainers all day every day give me a karen next come on give me a big karen here I am, I am so happy to suck those down. Okay, that was not the right terminology for that. But, dude, just keep pumping them out. I'm ready. Um, but, yeah, like I was saying, I, I dude, anything anything that I ate, I swear. I swear. Just straight to the old glutes, you know what I'm saying? Not, not in a good way either. It, I'm just jealous, man. I'm jealous. Not even when I was a kid did I have the gift. Oh, we're going to get Mexican food for the third time this week. That was going to be looking like a bowling ball in about three days. <laughs> I was I was chubby. Uh, like, uh, I'm tall, so it didn't help because tall people always look a little bit, like, bigger than they actually are. Even proportionally. They always look a little bit like, like they have more weight. Just if they're the exact proportion to someone else who's shorter, you just always look a little bigger. But dude, I was, I had the chubs going on when I was a kid, man. <laughs> you can go back and find like the, the latest remnants of that. It was like, it was like, as I was exiting that phase of my life, I was, that's when I first started making YouTube videos. Um, so you can go back and you can find those, those days. It's rough, man. It's rough. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> It was a it was a tough time in my life. I was having to diet as like a I don't even know how old man, like basically my entire life. <laughs> I want the gift, dude. I want that gift where people just naturally like, you know those friends you have, or maybe it's you where you just naturally have a six pack. You know, you just nat like you just you just are born and you exist and you have a six pack because of it. Can I like I, I think in my next life. Maybe if I like am nice enough and uh, donate enough money to charity or whatever, like I I think I could store up enough good karma to be someone who grows up having abs. 
and and continues to have abs into their adult life just just by default without having to work or anything I, uh, dear jesus i've seen what you've done for other people and i want that for me <laughs> uh, come on baby come on baby that's that that's how i'm sounding trying to pull this blaziken as well i see what dude i actually have not seen any video like i mean given i haven't really like i don't really follow a lot of pokemon youtubers dude it's been so long since i got this card such a creepy card um I don't really like religiously follow a ton of Pokemon YouTubers or anything, but um, I I have not seen like any video titles saying like we pulled it and it's the, it's the Blaziken alternate art. It's been, it's been a lot. I mean, this set's been out for a while. I'm sure there are videos of it, but as far as, far as like the other big Pokemon YouTubers that I, that I follow, like none of them, none of them have pulled it yet. It, I mean, it really is that difficult. It's literally a 1 in 500 seeded Pokemon card. Which, technically, I should have gotten by now. But then again, it's my luck we're talking about here. I don't have no glow luck. I've literally... I've probably opened up over 500 packs of Chilling Rain. I, I think I definitely have. hundred. Actually, a 1 million percent I've opened up more than that. I'm probably closer to like 800, 900 packs at this point. Odds are I should have pulled it right now. By now, that's not a bad card. We'll take it. We'll take it. Tornadus V Max. I'm hoping that there's one more big pull here in the last last three packs before we get into the Team Rocket. Although, if I could only have one good pull for the rest of the video, it'd be the Team Rocket. Because that this pack is way more expensive than these packs are. Given it's a guaranteed good card, but here we go, baby. Shuff it off the top. It's only if there's a Furfuru on the top do we get that extra bonus luck. Got an Ice Rider. And last pack. Coming in hot. Let's see if we get anything. And then we're opening up this Team Rocket pack. Let's get it. Dude, I just realized my entire Pokemon channel is just me taking cards and moving them to a different location. I move them either to my binders or into my bulk, like, Children's Hospital giveaway pile. That's crazy. That, that, that's kind of wild when you think about it. It's just me moving them around and putting it on camera. All right. It is time. So we have ourselves the Team Rocket. I haven't weighed this yet. I, I made a mistake when I bought these, and I didn't actually, like, confirm the weights of any of them. And I've more than paid the price for that multiple times over. Um, can you guys see the? Oh, there we go. If I cover the light right there, you can see. 20.88. I think 20.89. That's not the heaviest pack. But I have pulled uh, uh, hollows out of lighter than that. I have pulled hollows out of lighter. Yeah, the, these. I mean, if you have been watching the channel for a while, you know these are the these are the scam packs right here. Um, and some of them, it's been probably around fifty percent. And I paid a lot of money for these packs. It's been around fifty percent of them actually have been heavy. So, without further ado, we're looking for Squirtle. We're looking for Charmander. We're looking for Charmeleon. We're looking for War Turtle. We're looking for Eevee. And then, Mo oh, baby. Right on the top, a pristine first edition Eevee. Let's go, baby. Let's go. All right, three card trick. And, le and let's do this. So, reminder, reminder. Go all the way down to the beginning of Pokemon as it was formed. I'm going for a first edition only master set of Team Rocket. And any of these cards... I mean, mainly these three, but any of these cards would be a dub. All of these are hollow. This is a non-hollow. So, this is my second to last pack of Heavy Team Rocket First Edition. So, I'm really, really hoping that we manage to do this. Here we go. Whew. Dark Jolteon, great pull right off the bat. Any of the evolutions are great. We've got Rocket Secret Mach Machine, Digger. We've got K Dark Kadabra. Dude, please just give me one of the hollows. I I don't care which one. Give me the Alakazam. Give me the Dark Vile Plume. As long as it's one of the hollows that I don't that I need, and not one that I don't need, I will be happy. And uh, honestly, as long as it's a hollow, I'll be happy. Please. <laughs> Sleep. Abra. Come on, baby. Ekans. Please. 
Psyduck. Charmander. Great card. We got the Eevee and the Charmander and the Jolteon. Is this a sign of things to come? That, dude, that looks like a cap. Please. Ah! Scammed again. Scam literally scammed again. It's tough. Real tough. 